tons of people here. I work for downtown. I keep the city clean. <laughs> we come up this way and getting ready to clean. And all I seen was bees. It's up there. See it up there? Easily 2,000 bees. 2,500? Easily. Maybe more. It's about three pounds, about 10,000 bees that are up there. When I first noticed it, it looked like dog food, the brown little rock dog food. And I went close, I was like, oh wait, those are bees. <laughs> I was like, we better call somebody before somebody gets stuck. I'm gonna go up and save those girls, the swarm. They like to hang off the limb, and they're hanging on each other's legs. That's good, that's good. You said it's been gone for like 24 hours. I use a box, put them underneath it, shake the branch. If the queen falls into the box, they all follow her. To see something like this, it's cool. <laughs> I think we're good. We're good. Coming down. We'll pass it around. You know, we got a few people here. And come on over, folks, if you want to look. These bees are very, very docile. They fill themselves up with honey before they swarmed. You very seldom ever get stung. Hi, sweeties. You want to look closer? They don't sting me but they're very, very gentle. So let's see if we can get one to climb. There we go. Oh, she's so brave. There you go. She's walking very gently, isn't she? Woo! Woo! Who wants to hold bees? Yeah. Let's go, let's get it! That's a good look. <laughs> Queen's fine, everybody's flying around, so life is good. Oh, that's wild, isn't it? So the bees in that swarm were three banded Italian honey bees. Ray's story, the beekeeper there, says the queen will leave the hive and half of the bees will go with her, kind of like your ex and half your friends.